course, Habitat for Humanity was central to the work the Carters did post-presidency. Five years ago, that work brought them here to Michiana, where the Carters were part of a team that built 41 homes in Mishawaka and South Bend. Matt Gotch has the hometown part of our story. Jimmy and Rosalind Carter dedicated the last 40 years to helping everyday Americans fulfill their dreams and become homeowners. And one of the communities they helped build is right here in Michiana. Partnering with Habitat for Humanity, they helped build or improve dozens of homes in South Bend and Mishawaka in 2018. And Cleora Taylor lives in the house that President Carter worked on himself, also known as the house that Carter built. She was always by his side when I met her. She actually came up and grabbed me like this, and she was telling me who everyone was. Oh, she works at the White House. She, and I'm like, oh, my gosh, she is amazing. They were, like, so down to earth and so easily to be approached. Taylor says that while hearing of Mrs. Carter's death saddens her, she knows Rosalind's legacy will continue to live on. It was, it was pretty devastating, but she lived a wonderful life. She had a great husband, and she helped people. So her impact on the world is going to always remain, and she's going to always be remembered for all the great things that she's done. And I'm just so blessed and happy that me and my family got an opportunity to meet her because to, to meet someone with such an impact on the world, it definitely helped me as a person, as a mother. Um, the neighborhood, it's a great neighborhood. They, it was just amazing. It's just amazing to be a part of such a great thing. And Taylor says she is inspired by the Carters and the work they devoted the second half of their lives to. I just wish to be able to do the things that they did at their age when I get that age. Be able to, to get out and give back and care. To care to get people affordable living and care to, to have people become homeowners and have a piece of their own, th their own land and have a piece of the world, have a piece of the pie. And they helped me do that. So... I really, I, I really, um, she, she's going to be truly missed. The legacy is going to go on forever. And it's just, it just shows you how great people can be. For 16 News Now, I'm Matt Gotch. A purposeful love story. President Carter and Rosalind were married for more than 77 years. Rosalind Carter was 96 years old.